So, good morning everyone. This is X with Sally. And uh, we have, or I have been doing on Friday uh, some recipes that I have. It won't last that long. I promise not to bore you for the entire year. But I do like to share some of my moody surprises as I call them. So what you see before you right now is corn muffins, cornbread, that kind of thing. And uh, I don't know, it's just too blasé for me sometimes. Sometimes I like it just plain. But I like to throw in this, that, and the other thing. So what I've been doing is uh, my first one I used, it's, it calls for milk. And uh, let me see, let me see. This is the corn muffin mix that I use. Jiffy, super cheap, 49 cents I think. And um, yeah, what it calls for is the box of mix, of course, one egg, one third cup of milk, and you preheat the oven at 400 and you put it in a muffin pan, etc. So I decided I want to try a little different. So what I've done. The first time I used two tablespoons of oil, like you know how sometimes the cake mix is called. And I'm just going to interrupt here for one second because I'm cooking my hubby's breakfast. And what I've done, believe it or not, you know what the sausages cost nowadays, right? Well, I bought, one day I bought this Italian meat, Italian sausage meat. It was like for $2.10 or whatever. And what I did was I made little pieces like this and I threw in the egg. I like pork well done as you can see. Uh, undercooked pork is no good for you. And I made little pieces like this, threw in some scrambled eggs and voila. Uh, today I made two little patties because there was an abundance of meat left over in the one package. Yeah, what I do is I, uh, I'm going to turn this down. And what I do is I scramble eggs and do that. But I get a great big uh, package. And I do that with uh, sausage, hot dog sausages, whatever you call it. And what I do is, see, here's the Italian sausage, and I separate it for the morning. I got three of them out of this package. And the other thing that I do is I buy these sausage, hot dog sausage, can you see them? Yeah, comes in about, um, I think there's 20, I'm not sure, 20, 30. Anyway, I put four in little baggies, uh, and this way you don't unwrap the whole package and it goes bad because there's only two of us. So that's how I do it. I separate them, and that's one, two, three different meals. Now, actually, there was four because I used one, I think. Okay. Yeah, but that's what I do. I separate for the two. Yes, my husband's still smoking. Anyway. Um, yeah, that's going to be our breakfast. I'm going to lower that for now until I finish this. Anyway, back to the recipe. Uh, so you actually got two for the price of one. Um, the cornbread, as I told you the first time I tried applesauce. Delicious. It was really good. Um, last night, what I have tried was the mix, the milk. Well, actually half the milk that it called for. Uh, I put in my, actually I put in four tablespoons of applesauce, no, no, three, three tablesp heaping tablespoons of applesauce, two tablespoons of oil, and this time I added coffee meat, and it's Girl Scouts Mint, Mint, Thin Mints, and we're going to taste it, and, uh, if you'll just hold on one second 
See, I'm cutting with one hand. I am so talented. Oh, yes. Don't be bored, please. Um, and because, like, you know, a lot of people don't like cornbread because it's got that, I don't know, some people just don't like it. Okay? And this is how I usually cut it. Well, yeah. We'll have this with coffee or maybe dessert or something like that. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to taste this for you. Ha ha ha! This is my part. Okay, who wants to buy it? Come on over. I would love to have you. But we're all snowed in right now. Okay, I'm going to try this. And like I say, the new piece is with the Girl Scout. Thin Mints Cream. I did taste the batter, and the batter was really good yesterday. Oh, this is good. This is so moist. Mmm. And you can really taste that Thin Mint. Mmm. So moist. And yet taste the applesauce. This is like cake. Mmm. Better than cake. Yeah, this is good. You really got to try this. Mm. Oh, yeah. Corn muffin mix. Uh, half the milk that it calls for. And then fill the rest of it up with this Coffee Mate. It's uh, one-third cup of milk. So do half of that with milk and half with the Coffee Mate. Hell, you can do it all with the Coffee Mate. And then, of course, the two... Or three heaping spoons of tablespoons of um, heaping tablespoons of applesauce, and then the two tablespoons of oil, uh, or one, you know, just to give it some moisture. Maybe you don't even need that with the cream. Yeah. Mm. So there you go. Two recipes for the price of one. Uh, just trying to, as I think I've told a few of you, my husband's been laid off since Thanksgiving. Just trying to cut corners here. Uh, we went to all these yesterday. The coffee mate I got for a review. I got three different kinds. And uh, the Jiffy is 49 cents. The applesauce, I believe, was 69 cents at all these. Um, sausage, when you buy it, it's $1.99 for what? Six? Eight? No, eight. $1.99 for the box. And here I got for two something i think it was like 249 for this scraping package of italian sausage meat not not the sausages just the meat and i separate them in sandwich bags and uh it's good for you know like three or four meals for two at least and uh but if you got kids at least it would be good for you know two or three meals that was the bag and if you want to come over for supper, for breakfast, come on over. But that's what you're going to have to travel through around here. This is my kitchen window. And there is our winter stuff. You know, that used to be my patio. It's now a chunk of snow and ice. And there's across the street. And they did plow the streets this morning, so... And it doesn't look too cool. We've broken down some of the ice uh, due to um, the, uh, what do you call it, the uh, stuff you have in the attic, the, the stuffing, the uh, pink stuff, insulation. Uh, it wasn't put up there right, so we have moisture, and now what's happening is that. And my husband has put some... Um, salt bags on the roof hoping to make these moisture rivers or something so it'll slide off and not slide in so not only do we have that damage but we also have this is the ceiling you're looking at this is my hallway damage isn't that awful that's gonna cost a buck but he's doing what he can He's Googled it and found all kinds of stuff to do, and that's what we're doing. And, you know, this is right by my back door, so. Anyway, 
that's it. And uh, thank you for sharing my morning with me. And I will talk to you another day. Have a great day. Stay warm. Be careful. Be aware of your surroundings. Hugs to all. Bye.